It's looking good, it's looking right Been through the days and through the nights I felt the pressure, I felt the pain Feel good now Welcome to another episode of Wake Up Wednesday. Today, we're going through this workout, man. We're gonna be doing shoulders and abs. I always talk about the abs because for me, like your core, your abs is very important. If you don't have that, that's when you get a weak back, you get your legs ain't as strong, everything. You gotta hit the core. So we're gonna go through a crazy workout today. And right now we're on week 11. Like I said, if you start something and you take it, you don't look at the whole picture. Again, this is a 16 week program. We just go week by week by week by week. And we made it to 11. Best believe we're gonna get to 16, but I'm just showing you. If you take it one step at a time, you'll get there. And the new shirts just came in. Feel good now, like I said, it's a movement. It's not just a little phrase, it's a movement, man. So go on the website, if you like the shirts, order them. Support the movement. Tell your friends, tell your family, everybody, man. Because ultimately, when we do things, we wanna feel good. So until next time, feel good now. Welcome to another episode of Wake Up Wednesday. First thing I want to say, you know, give a shout out to the guys at Muscle Farm. I don't know them, but uh, just give a shout out for them for putting out this uh, workout. This is a 16 week workout program and this this really challenges your body. So we're on week, we're on phase three right now, week 11, and we're hitting shoulders. So the first exercise we want to do is the Arnold press. And then we're going to superset this with some ab twist. This is just something I added in the abs part of it. So what we do is, since there's three of us working out, instead of standing around waiting for the next guy to go, well, I'll throw something in there just to keep busy. You don't want to stand around and waste time and cool that cool your muscles down. I like to just keep keep going. My, that's why my endurance, I could go for a long period of time. So what we do is four sets of, of 20 on the Arnold press. Then we come over here, we do four sets of 30 on the ab twist. You know, and. You know, the best thing is about watching myself on video or watching, you want to tape yourself so you can critique yourself and see what you're doing right or wrong. Because right there, I just saw what I was doing with the Arnold press. My, my, my elbows got to come closer, come in more, and then turn them out. You know, so videos allow you to see yourself, critique yourself, learn. Because next time I go to the gym now, I'm going to be willing to, I know what I have to do next time I go there to make it right. This is why we, you know, you're, my, our endurance is up because we're doing four sets, of, four sets of 20. We're not doing four sets of 10, 15. We're doing four sets of 20. So you have to pick a, a good weight that you can get up there 15 times. It's 17th, you're struggling, ninth, all the way, you get it all done. And we just push each other, man. So that's the good thing about going there with these guys because our energy is high. We push each other to get it done. So now we're going to move on to just regular dumbbell press now. Again, we, we're still doing four sets of 20, but this is a tri-set now. So we go from regular dumbbell press, front lateral raises, four sets of 20, and side lateral raises, four sets of 20. So this one, oh man, when you're done, your shoulders are going to be on fire. You go, remember, you're going from one exercise to the next three exercises. So you have to be mentally tough to get through this part. Because it hurts, man. At 15, you're like, oh, you just want to throw the weights down, you know? But like I said, I discipline myself. These guys are disciplined, and we just come in and we do what we have to do. We get it in and we get out. People who are looking to, to try this program, go to bodybuilding.com, that's where I got it from, and it's called the Get Swole Program. You know, I'd recommend you, you get a partner when you come to do this because it does get pretty, it gets really hard. And, you know, I could go in there and do it by myself, but me coming here with these guys, 
I got a, I think I, I got a lot more out of it as opposed to if I was to do it by myself because they're here every day. They're holding me accountable. I'm holding them accountable. So we're, we know we got to show up. There's, trust me, there's days you, you get up out the bed, you can't move your body because you're sore from going through this. But you know those other guys are going to be there. So you don't want to let them down and they don't want to let you down. So this is why, for me, programs like this, it's important to have partners. But if you're a guy who works out on your own, again, if you're that disciplined, like I could come in here and do this on my own and get it all done. But again, I think I got more benefit than coming with these guys because every day I knew I had to show up. I wasn't just showing up for me, I was showing up for them. So if you're going to start this program, get some partners who are serious, who's going to come and hold you accountable. Now this is the last workout for shoulders and you see we're just at one plate here because what you want to do is lift the weight, hold it for two seconds, drop it, hold it for two seconds and we're just doing one set of 20. <laughs> After doing all that, try doing this. It, it, this right here just puts a big, big, lot of pressure on, the, on your traps, man. And that's when, when I'm done and we're done, we feel like your traps are just, you're just standing up straight. counts right here now it's my favorite thing is that the abs you know so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna do a, a circuit and this is something I put in on my own we just go mountain climbers for 30 seconds then we're gonna flip over and do these sits V sits and reach up with the weight for 30 seconds then we're gonna flip over and we're gonna do crunches for 30 seconds then we're gonna take a 30 second break and start the whole cycle all over again. But this time we're gonna twist it, bring the knees to the elbow now for 30 seconds. Back to the reach, 30 seconds. Crunches for 30 seconds. We're gonna do four sets of these. You know, and, I, and again, to the guys at Muscle Farm, man, like these guys are doing their thing, you know. When you do workouts like this and you drain your body like this, you definitely wanna get some protein in you. Oh yeah, this is where it hurts, man. This is the abs. You, you, you gotta go hard. I talk about the abs a lot because I know, I know what it takes to, to get it. And when I go to do the abs, I don't play, man. I just go hard. I don't care what it is. I go. I heard Muhammad Ali said, fly like a butterfly, stand like a bee. Then he says, I don't count. I count when it hurts. You know, so you gotta just make up your mind. Put it in your mind that I'm not gonna fail. I'm gonna do it. That's it. That's why I'm here. Like, do it. Just don't be afraid, man. If it hurts, it hurts. It, it's going to go away. Then we go over here and we got to do some knee raises. And we're doing four sets of 15 after doing all that. You've got to have a strong core. I like to do things like this because, man, like when I'm playing basketball, I know I'm in shape. I, I could move around. If it's time for me to go to the beach or jump in a pool or something, you're, you're just in shape. You feel good, right? So you have to work hard in the gym to get the results outside of the gym to feel good about yourself. Oh, yeah, you could tell it hurts. You could see it. When I go through the pain, feel good, feel good now. Now this last exercise is like, I just, like I said, I put different things in because I like to keep agile. I don't want to be too stocky and can't move around. So I put this in at the end of it. You know, we're doing dips, which hits your chest. And then we do it, hitting the, the, lifting up the legs. That's going to hit your abs. After doing that whole workout and then you're doing this, that just shows your endurance and what you can do. 
you know so make sure you check out my channel subscribe tell a friend comment on the videos check it out every Wednesday we be here I'm here to stay we're not this wake up Wednesday's not going anywhere until next time feel good now It's looking good, it's looking right And through the days, and through the nights I felt the pressure, I felt the pain Feel good now